We are looking for anything that looks like drugs or paraphernalia. The movie Gosnell, The Trial of America's Biggest Serial Killer, focuses in on the story of Dr. Kermit Gosnell, an inner city Philadelphia abortionist. But it tells this man's gruesome tale without actually showing the gruesome deeds themselves. I mean, you gotta see this. Is this normal? I don't know, I've never been in an abortion clinic before. Instead, it helps us understand this man's horrible and deadly choices through his courtroom trial. Healthy woman goes into a clinic, comes out dead, and there's no police report? Files have been moved recently. Look at this. We watch as gutsy Philadelphia prosecutor Alexis McGuire and a pair of dedicated detectives gather the evidence to make their case that Gosnell had murdered hundreds, maybe even thousands of babies over the course of his career, an atrocity that many knew of but purposefully chose to ignore. You are not going to believe what I saw last night. How many? So far, we found over 30 of them. This is a hard story to comprehend due to Gosnell's callousness and even his narcissism. It's the kind of story that stays with you because you'd swear it was all fiction, except that it isn't. Anyone considering this film needs to know that its graphic verbal depictions of how an abortion happens spare little. As difficult as the subject matter is, however, this is an important movie. It's a film that will no doubt change the way some viewers understand the tragedy of abortion, a movie that could help someone make the right choice for an innocent life. I'll give Gosno a three out of five for family friendliness. For an in-depth review of this film, or really anything else at your local box office, visit us at PluggedIn.com. Plugging you into the movies, I'm Bob Olszewski for Focus on the Families, Plugged In, Movie Review.